All right, guys, we're heading right into the interview. Clayton, what do you got for us, man? What is up, ladies and gentlemen of Perfect Alliance? We are joined here with the winning squad, Swarm, and their oh, captain, uh, Haley. Haley, what uh, what do you go by in game? Uh, Galaxy. Swarm Galaxy. Galaxy. Yes. All right, so we've got Galaxy here with us, along with all three of our other teammates. <laughs> uh, how are you? How are you, ladies, feeling after that win? Good victory. Thank you. I'm um, feeling pretty good, I guess. <laughs> Did you come um, into this yeah. show match thinking you were gonna take take it away, like um, like you did, or did you guys figure there was gonna be more matches? It was pretty quick tonight. Well, we haven't really heard much about the other team. We didn't know if they were gonna be like really good. We didn't know that much about them. So uh, right. I mean, we we were trying to stay confident, but not to underestimate the other right. team. So okay, so confident yeah. yet cautious. We can uh, we can appreciate yeah. that. That's a good good way to go into most of these matches. Uh, however, you ladies did take it away and. Uh, Tell us a little bit about your squad. How long have you ladies been together uh, as a team? Um, I'd say about uh, maybe a month or two. <laughs> uh, we kind of broke up and then got back together. So this is kind of like our, we're just running again and like trying to get things back in order. Okay. But, uh, well, uh, yeah, we saw some good plays out of you guys. Obviously, um, some minor work to be done, and, and you yeah. guys can definitely Im improve on that. And we'll talk a bit, a little bit about that in a minute. But uh, tell us, going into this last match that you had, um, you know, the, the game's on the line. You win this one, you can take it home. If you lose, mm -hmm. you got to play again. What's the mindset going in there? How do you guys go in to close this one out? Um, well, when we won the last game, we kind of just carried in the momentum. So we just... We're like, come on, guys, we got this. Let's win this out on my host. <laughs> um, yeah, we just kind of like stayed confident, I guess, just kept up the momentum going. Right. So having that host advantage um, obviously was uh, was good for you guys. Yeah. And like I said, playing off that momentum onto your host was uh, was definitely um, mm -hmm. a good a good pickup uh, for you, ladies. Now, tell us a little bit about um, how you guys practice when you're coming in here and you're you're going to scrim. Uh, teams or you're going to play show matches and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. What do you four ladies do uh, individually to kind of prep for this match? Do you play um, as a group? Do you play as doubles? Uh, how yeah. does that kind of that setup work? Well, we have like a set schedule. Every day we get on at like 5.30. We warm up together. Um, today, actually, we had our pep talk. We have a pep talk every Friday and um, we just kind of talked about like the things that we needed to work on on like the different um, game modes. So we kind of just went over those things before we played, and then we did a few team scrims before we hopped in. So we just kind of like wanted to keep warm. Awesome. Well, this next question we'll do uh, for each individual lady here. Um, what kind of uh, tips or pointers can you give to upcoming uh, amateur lady teams who are looking to make a name for themselves in the Call of Duty community who we all know can be toxic at some times? Here at the PA family, we like to keep everything <laughs> clean and fun and competitive. Mm -hmm. How would you advise up and coming ladies teams um, to get into, uh, you know, this esports world? And what's some advice you can give them to counteract some of that controversy, which we know they're going to face on their way? Out? <laughs> um, I'd say probably just talking to people, doing aids, doing ladies night for sure. That gets your name out, and it gives you a good way to like meet other ladies that are free agents and stuff like that. It's all it's just a really good way and like talking to people and stuff like that. Kelly? Um, yeah. Um, well, like, once you play, you should just say, like, GG's and don't, like, act professional. Don't start talking shit or anything. Because <laughs> <laughs> that's just not a good way to go. Because people aren't going to. Very true. Respect that. And that's what I like. Professional to and, especially yeah. in pubs and stuff where you have the ability to, you know, talk shit and, and get away with it. Being professional even in a pub can can be a good, uh, good name for you. So, uh, next we'll hear from Sam. <laughs> um, honestly, I think they said everything that, yeah, just a big thing is don't put your name out there as a bad, like, a, don't influence other people to, like, talk crap about the other team and try to stay off Twitter with that kind of stuff, like, just keep it in with your team. Good point. Because <laughs> we've had a few problems with that before, and it's actually really, like, put us in a bad spot. And we kind of did not want that, so yeah. That's kind of why we created our whole like group talks every Friday to just like sort things out, get everybody on the right, right. page, make sure there's no like bad blood, bad blood going on anywhere. Just make sure everybody's straight. Like okay. keep your composure. 
Yep. And last but not least, we have Jasmine. Jasmine, what are your words and wisdoms for the up and coming PA <laughs> or just any ladies' teams? Well, I could take it from account that I was the one that was causing most of the blood <laughs> blood between ladies because um I I have an alter ego that really gets out of place. So they uh the girls helped me by t telling me to ignore it tell them to just show up do what you do in game to tell people that they're wrong and then if you lose you just keep on going and prove them right. every time so let your game speak for itself basically, basically. is what's uh, <laughs> yeah. taken from these ladies and those are wise words for any of the ladies that are out there watching tonight if you're looking to do um you know big things on, on the competitive scene you're looking to get an amateur team up these ladies can definitely give you some advice so make sure you check them all out on twitter they all they all have got twitters and i'm sure john has done a great job posting that up somewhere <laughs> so check them out and um we're going to move on to our last question we ask this every show match uh this is directed directly towards you as the captain haley um yes. we know this is a team sport and we know it takes all four people to win and, um, you know, teamwork is definitely key. But we like to give out the PA game gun, basically the MVP of the game. Who in your mind tonight out of these ladies played their hearts out? And without them, maybe the match would have been a little different. Maybe you lose another <laughs> one or uh, maybe you don't close out on the uh, on the last round. So who tonight played uh, played like a star? Um, Honestly... Do I have to choose? <laughs> you got I mean, to. Everybody did great. That's yeah. what we're, we're that eleven playing field. But who tonight stood out and just kind of wowed you as a captain? Well, honestly, going to make the other ladies work just as hard. Honestly, getting back together as a team, I'd say Clarity has really impressed me because before she wasn't getting as many kills as she has been now, and right. tonight she's been getting, you know, those OBJ captures as well as getting a lot of kills. And normally she just like stays alive in the hill, and I mean that's what wins games. So I mean she go. really she's really impressed me tonight. So game gun going to Clarity. Congratulations on that. Thank you, ladies, so much for joining us tonight. We're gonna give you a quick second here to uh, shout out any. Uh, organization owners sponsors uh, other teams you want to say um, hi to whatever you whatever you want to say you've got the floor for a little bit um, <laughs> and go ahead and take it away <laughs> all right Haley you go first Len Kelly then Sam then me let's get it <laughs> wait what I'm ready I'm ready <laughs> for it shout, shout out your friends shout out, your oh, yeah, sh shout uh, out to your org and your owners and your friends and oh you know, yeah okay uh, whoever those people are. shout out to the swarm guys team um our owners and everything, yeah. <laughs> yeah I don't know. <laughs> and anybody who was very Reacta, supporting us over Niz, the past. Uh, Grover. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm just throwing names out there. Um. Whoa. Hold on. <laughs> I, I, oh Lord, uh, ladies. <laughs> <laughs> phobia. <laughs> yeah, phobia. Phobia has been um, a big supporter. Our sponsors is Q Controllers, <laughs> Esport, Raven, and Gamebox. Yeah. There you go. Shout out to those sponsors, uh, making it happen for this ladies team. And, I got a uh, question, Clayton. Yes, sir. I have a question, and it's gonna go. To, it's gonna go to Haley. Uh, yes. Haley, <laughs> I'm thinking next Friday night, mm -hmm. Swarm Ladies goes up against EX Ladies. I'm trying to confirm this oh, man. right now. I am 100% down. There. Don't put my heartstrings on. Don't put my heartstrings no, on. No, no, we gotta squad. confirm this. <laughs> They're a good right squad. Now. We seem to scream them all the time, so I mean, I'm I'm totally down. So you guys have played them before. Yeah, yeah. Shiki is yes. my uh, spirit animal. Okay. How, how are those How are those scrims? Pretty evenly evenly matched. Um, that's classified. <laughs> well, we're gonna have to find oh, out. Here, Friday. Here's, he's trying to get at: Is it gonna be a good show match? Oh yeah, one hundred percent. One hundred percent. There we go. All right, so can we make that happen, Haley? Yes. Let's Friday night, EX lady is gonna I'm go up hype against right now. ladies. Same I'm gonna time. get I'm gonna get the best casters available to get that one going for sure. Do that. <laughs> so we're gonna make it a big show match. Let me know if you guys have any issues or can't make it happen. Let Ann know. We're gonna okay. get that set up for next Friday. Again, thank you guys so much for coming on the show match. You guys did a great job signing up, sending over the logos and all that good stuff. Skype detail uh, is very very much appreciated. But we're done. And I just want to give a quick shout out to our sponsors, Honey Badger and Razor. Make sure you're checking those guys out, doing huge stuff. We didn't hit 100 viewers tonight, so we couldn't give away the Honey Badger. But guys, we're live Monday, Wednesday, and Friday night with show matches. Make sure you're signing up your squad, pa-gaming.net. 
We're done. Have a great weekend. We're back Monday night, 9 p.m. Central Standard Time. Peace. Goku, you always got something to say. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, ladies, for joining us. You guys.